Hi there, it's Ivan here at carolineivanair.com. Um, in this video, which is uh, I think the third or fourth in the sequence of uh, how to make videos on a shoestring, I want to look at microphones. Now, in the video of the back cameras, I was uh, I sort of stressed the point to look for a uh, camera that has an input for a, a, a microphone jack because the sound quality is so much better than relying on the onboard microphone that comes with uh, all video cameras. Now, that doesn't have to be an expensive alternative. The camera itself, uh, as I've already said, was 50 quid, I think, uh, second hand on eBay. Um, works just fine. The microphone, I also bought on eBay as well. You can see I've got one on here at the moment, but this is the identical one. I bought two, one for me and one for Carol at the same time. And it's a simple clip mic. Uh, I bought one with a longer lead. They, they come in all sorts of lead lengths. I think this is about six meters, so I can stand about 18 feet away from uh, from from the camera, if if, uh, if I wanted to, uh, but I bought a longer uh, longer lead uh, mic just for that very reason. Um, but they, as I say, they come in much shorter uh, shorter lengths than that. Uh, it simply clips on, goes up my sh up inside my shirt, clips on, and the other end has got the jack that plugs into um, into the camera. No technical stuff at all. It's very simple. So that's one. And I think I paid something like. Seven pounds, ten dollars for that. Um, so again, not at all expensive. There's no excuse for not getting on with this. Now, the one extravagance in all that uh, that I've um, had is this microphone here, which I'll show you. Which I use for. You've probably seen some of the um, the, the screen capture videos that we've done, um, PowerPoint uh, presentations, and so on and so forth. Um, this mic is rather more expensive. This was about £100, about $150, and it's a USB mic, um, but it does give very good sound quality. Um, but clearly it's not very attractive having it sat here um, while I'm making a, a, a video such as this, so we rely on this mic. Now, so far, I uh, haven't done much outside broadcasting. Now, I would just flag up that if you intend to do that, You've probably seen the, the professionals on TV, they've got these little fluffy things on their mic. Some people call them squirrel tails, some people rather more prosaically call them dead cats. But they're little fluffy things that fit on the mic. Be sure to get one of those. Again, they're not very expensive, only a few pounds, a few dollars. Um, get one of those to fit over your mic because it really does deaden the wind noise. Because if you ever make a video out there uh, and it is the least bit windy, even though you can't hear it out there, the microphone really picks it up. Um, so if I just blow on this mic now, you'll probably see what I mean. I was only blowing really, really gently then, but probably, and again, I haven't heard that yet, but that was probably pretty loud through your speakers. So um, you do need to get one of those little furry things, the, the, the dead cat squirrel tail things, uh, to fit on your mic. But again, just to let you know, seven, seven pounds, $10, $50 for, for the camera. I'm really, we're, uh, sorry, 50 pounds for the camera, $70 for the camera. We really are talking on a shoestring here. I shall see you again very soon.